Hey guys, I'm here talking about men's skincare. This is video number three. If you haven't checked out video number one or two, definitely check them out. You can click the little I in the upper right hand corner on mobile or on computer to pull up some of the other videos that I've connected to this video, including video number one, where I talk about cleanser and daytime moisturizer, nighttime moisturizer. Video number two, where I say, okay, if you wanna take it to the next level, here are some other things. Now we're on video number three one more level I'm going to take you to and that's to add one more product three nights a week um, either a beta hydroxy or an alpha hydroxy now for me alpha hydroxy didn't work beta hydroxy works for me and this is normally suggested to people who have oily skin I don't really have oily skin when I was a teenager I had some in the nose and chin but now I don't but I get dry skin. I've had eczema on my face before. I got a little bit of um, rosacea, but even if you don't have that, this is a great product. I get this from Paula's Choice. I've gotten it for a long time. I've tried it both in the, um, in the gel and in the lotion. I like the gel better. It even lasts longer, and I get the 2%. So this is when I use it. I do cleanser. This would come next three nights a week. That's it. So you could do Monday, Wednesday, Friday. It comes in a pump type bottle. I do one pump and it can go on my fingertips because it's thick. I rub it between my fingers. I put it all on my face. I avoid the eye area. I let that sink in for a few minutes. Then going back to video number two, then I do my vitamin C serum and which other, other, which other serum, whichever other serum <laughs> I'm using, which is right now the Coenzyme Q10 but I have used their Matrixel, that's more Matrixel, this has Matrixel, and this has hyaluronic acid. Then last is, because I'm using this at night, the moisturizer, which was the CeraVe. So, um, yeah, this is exfoliating. When I say I avoid the eye area, I don't come down here, I don't do it up here. I do put the, um, the serums here on the eye, but this I don't, okay. Um, but this is great for fine lines. It's great for behind the scenes, <laughs> very quietly exfoliating the little surface cells of skin. Now I'm going to give you one other tip, guys, and a lot of you won't like hearing this, but it very it is very much anti-aging, and that's changing your diet. And by that, I mean increasing the amount of fresh vegetables and fresh fruit you're eating. And the easiest way to do that, I described in one of my books, which is available as an ebook on Amazon. And I step people through how I change my diet. So the best way is to eat fruit all morning, have a huge salad. If that doesn't hold you, your snacks in the afternoon can be raw nuts and seeds, um, some more vegetables, another piece of fruit. And then at dinner, you can start off by eating whatever you want, but it'll help you get a lot more nutrition into your diet, um, better uncooked foods just from the time you get up till dinner time. If you're eating like that during the day, it'll cut back on your fat, it'll cut back on your sugar intake, it'll cut back even on your caffeine. If you're a big coffee drinker or pop drinker, um, just these habits, if you can change them one at a time, it'll make it easier on you, but it will give you another way of looking younger. So I didn't show this picture in my other videos, but maybe I'll show it now. It's a picture of my dad and me. I was 17 in this picture, and my dad was younger than I am now by, gosh, three or four years. I'm three or four years older than he is in that picture, and I have his skin. So between diet change when I was 38 and skin care, that's been huge. I didn't start wearing sunscreen until I was about 34, 35, and full spectrum sunscreen until I was about 36 because they weren't talking about it and they didn't really have it out there, not for face anyway. So. Yeah, this stuff works, and for those of you who are in your 30s, if you're watching this and you change your skin care and your diet, you're going to remember this video 20 or 25 years from now and remember, that woman was the one who suggested.
instead of I make these changes. And you're going to notice it because people you went to school with are going to look a lot older than you do. All right. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Check out some of my other videos by clicking the little eye in the upper right hand corner besides video number one and number two. And thanks for watching. Bye.